Hello, my name is Ariel Pozwolski, pre-sales engineer of Algol. Today we're going to be talking uh, about uploading custom audio files to your range of Algol IP speakers, paging adapters, etc. Um, Algol speakers come with one gigabyte of memory available for uploading custom files. Uh, in terms of speakers, we're generally talking audio files really. Two formats are supported, WAV or MP3. As far as uh, sampling rate, None of that matters, just make sure it's a WAV or MP3 format. Um, where are you logged in? It is in default settings. I'm in the status tab. I'm gonna head right over to the system tab in the opposite corner. And under system, we're gonna head over to file manager. That's where we can manage uh, files that, are, that have been uploaded or upload new ones. Um, of course, we are uploading audio files for the sake of the example here. We're gonna head over to the tones directory and we can already see uh, the 10 or 12 tones that ship with the device from factory. These can be deleted or they can be left here. Really, they take up little to no space and a gigabyte of memory is really a lot of storage for audio files alone. So it's unlikely that you would ever run out of storage. Um, now, two options, you can either drag and drop files. It can be a single file or multiple files into the folder and let it upload. Or you can use the upload button in the top left top left corner, I'm going to use the upload button. Either way, it works the same way. I only happen to have one file here for the sake of testing. If I had 10, I could select all 10. So it is uploading. We got the uh, bar showing progress. And then we can see at the very bottom here, drum, drum row.wave. It is a fairly small file. It is ready in our system. And that's about it. It's, very, it's a very simple process. So that wraps up uploading uh, audio files to the file manager. For any questions or support, please contact the Algo team.